to show you how to get uh, two free new horses, which is the Red Arabian that is near Strawberry, and the new uh, the new spotted I think um, horse is near Tumbleweed and Armadillo, I believe. So right now, where I'm at, I am at Strawberry. I'm here. And I believe that one of the Red Arabians are probably around up here or somewhere down here. But I think it is near Strawberry, I believe. But this isn't tall tree, so it's probably not going to be over here. It's probably going to be in the big valley. Probably in one of these trails, or maybe right over here. I am not really sure. All I know is that you can find a free red Arabian for you without going to the stables and buying it. Now, in order to go to this wild horse, you have to come into Strawberry and maybe look on YouTube of how to get the free Arabian, red Arabian, if you do not want to buy it at the stables, which is here. And I do have a max of bounty around this, only in this area, I believe. And I'm playing as John Marston. You cannot find these horses in Red Dead Online, but you can buy the Red Arabian, but you cannot get it if it's in the wild, I believe. But if you want to try to go online on Red Dead Redemption 2 and try and look for the Red Arabian somewhere near Strawberry, go ahead. But I believe it's somewhere here. Or maybe over here, which is I don't think you could come in this area. I think you can. So it has to be somewhere here. So I'm going to come here, all here, and I'm going to go around the place see if I can find the red Arabian that you can get and so I have my big old trusty horse so we are gonna go and find this red Arabian now I heard that if you get off your horse when you find it and slowly approach it it will be so much easier to actually get the horse instead of it running away so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna get off my horse slowly get close to it when I find it and if I do find it and those are some bounty hunters so we're gonna keep going because I do not want to mess with them <laughs> I but I don't have enough money to pay my bounty as you guys can see I'm very low on money on online and offline because I've been spending my money on most things. So, um, I think it's around here somewhere. I'm not too sure. If it isn't, I might have to look on YouTube to see if it is around Strawberry. Because I believe it is around Strawberry. So, I think they said it's somewhere in the mountains I don't know I'm just trying my best to find this free Arabian so that way I don't have to use my money it's I don't think my horse can get up there it might be somewhere up here on top of the one of these mountains or it might be in a different area I'm not too sure. I might have to look on YouTube once again to find this horse. Or I can use my eagle eye. I can't. Those are animals. Those are deers. I think I might have to look on YouTube again and find this red. Arabian. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go on my phone right now and My amino is going crazy like always <laughs> uh, Let's see here Go on YouTube. I got 
um, one of the free horses that were wild and pretty much it was very cool <laughs> very cool let's see Red Dead Redemption 2 where to find the wild red oh I spelled red wrong okay oh I spelled it wrong again Arabia. Okay. Um, how to get Red Arabia? I want Red Chestnut Arabian location. Okay, I think that's what I need. Oh no, this is the one I need. So I'm gonna turn on my volume and I'm gonna go straight into it to try and find the Red Arabian location. So if it's gonna show to me the lovely little horse. Then we might be able to uh, get the horse. Alright. So it should show on the map where to find the horse. If But if I'm in the wrong uh, location, I could always just make a camp and go to it. So let's see here if it will show me on its map. Come on. Okay. So I am a little bit not close. I was wrong. The Red Arabian is somewhere in this area. The person will zoom in and put a place mark. Okay, so the person zoomed in from here and then came all the way to, I think, between. Here is where you can find the Red Arabian. So I'm going to go there, see if I'm right with this location, and uh, yeah, see if we can tame this beast without trying to kill my old trusty poor horse. Whatever you do, if you have like a huge bonding level for one and only horse, you will be able to do the thing that I just did. And if you accidentally fall over, it's okay. Unless if you have horse revivers, you're fine. But if you don't have horse revivers and if there's a huge cliff and you just make your horse jump straight off it or without you on it, that deer was flying. What the hell? Okay. Um, so if you try to like try and make your horse jump off a cliff without you on it, it will apparently kill it completely. Alright, so here we are at the location. I'm gonna see if it's right and see if I can. Do you guys see that? I just saw something. Do you guys see that? Look right up there. There it is, there it is, guys. There you there it is. The red wild chestnut Arabian. That is a beautiful wild horse. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm gonna get close as possible, crouch, and try and tame it without making it run off. Now this can go like in a very bad situation. Either the horse will immediately kick me off its back, or the horse will like me a little bit. So I'm just gonna trot a little bit up there. I don't wanna trot too much up there. And this is trotting, so I want to get up there, not too close, because I don't want to scare it. Maybe come up here, and there it is, guys. See, look, it's looking down at us. It's like, hello, what are you going to do? There's a horse, we're going to study it, and it will say Arabian. Red Chestnut Arabian. This is a wild horse that I, well, I always buy these horses but if they're in the wild I will just immediately go after them but these red Arabians black Arabians white other Arabians that are new that are being added to the game is a very good sitting horse for you because they are the fastest horses in the world and they can even be used for like like dancing competitions of uh, racing competitions even jumping competitions so I want to get close to this guy as possible without scaring him 
I don't know if it's a male or female though, so I'm gonna place Slippers right here. Making him stay, okay. Now we are gonna get it as close as possible with probably not our ropes. I wanna get close as possible with this guy. So here we go, we're crouching. You always have to crouch or else you will scare the horse off. Well the horse is peeking up its head, looking around. And it's moving away. Oh. Okay, there it is. So you guys do not want to go and rush to it. Maybe get as close as I can and call it. Hello! Okay, now the horse will start freaking out. So this is a better way how to capture a wild horse instead of just running straight towards it and throwing a rope around its neck. The best way for you is to get as close as you can to the horse without on your horse and try and do what I did because I usually crouch it then go slowly towards it and look at this beast in and I see that it is a boy so as you can see you can see how perfect and cute and sparkling how this horse is take a look at him all right we're gonna give him a couple pats see taming a wild Arabian is so much better than fucking buying a Arabian because the wild Arabian you don't even have to use them like, you don't even have to buy them. You can just come to this location and immediately tame these horses. So, I'm going to call my... So, I'm going to go on this horse, get a call on mine just in case if I fall off. And I'm going to try and tame this beast. So, come on. I know you don't like me. You have to deal with it. <laughs> come on. Oh, oh. Now, when you call your horse sometimes and it gets stuck like this, I usually just do like a frenzy, moving my joystick left and right, and see, there we go, we have a male Arabian, a wild male Arabian. You can only find this horse once in the wild, and once it dies, it will respawn. But if you try to come here again, I don't think it will spawn another, unless if you buy another Arabian just like this, or if you just want to keep the wild Arabian, which is... Really cool, <laughs> really cool, really cool. So what we are going to do is probably go to the other location to the little bit of the spotted other horse. Now this horse might be able to be spotted near Armadillo and uh, Tumbleweed. I think, I am not really too sure. All I know is that I went there and I tamed that horse, but that horse can be tamed more than once. There are other horses that spawn like it, male or female. Last time I tamed it first, I got a male, but I wanted a female. And there was another horse just like it. So I went, and that horse tend actually came out as a Arabian. And I don't know if that's a wolf or whatever that is. Whatever it is, I don't have my gun, so I'm gonna go to it with my two pistols and mess it up because why not if it's a wolf of my kind then I am sorry but you might never know who you, you might never know what that animal is all right so there it is I'm gonna follow it it's a red I have no clue what it is and it's a baby bear too bad we are gonna mess it up because why not and just like that, that's how you kill. That's that's how you kill a bear that was just drinking from the pond. But since I'm low on money, I don't really care about the pelts and meat. I only care about showing you how to get these two amazing horses. Now the red Arabian, which is this one, is the best choice for you. If you don't remember where the location is, come around around here, near. I don't know how to pronounce that lake's name. <laughs> But around here, you will find the Red Arabian Chestnut. Now, the next location is the Spotted Horse, which is, it looks like a Dalmatian horse, but it's so, so much different. So, I'm going to come on the map here, and I am going to go all the way to probably down here, because I have no clue where I'm going. And here is Armadillo and Tumbleweed. Now this horse is between um, 
armadillo and tumbleweed so I'm just gonna click a random map right for right now and when you actually create I think a bonding level with this horse it will be able to follow you or you can just go to your stables real quick and sell it or keep it but for me I don't have enough room on my stables because my horse is already full with friends from amino especially my own horse that i immediately tamed when i first the new update first came out i immediately tamed the new arabian when i go into the stables i will show you guys that bird just ran into me like a freaking moron <laughs> so we are gonna go to my stables and I'm going to show you guys my horses that I have. My horses. And this horse right behind me that's following me is a horse that looks like a friend of mine on Amino. And of course, if you guys have Amino, you might know him. And his name is Sibylus. So, he's my favorite horse. When I first saw this horse color in the horse skin and mane and tail, I was like... Okay, this is 100% gonna be Sibylus' horse version, so here you go. Here's, um, here's Sibylus. He's, he's a beautiful horse, but these, these guys can be fine, uh, I think some, I think these horses can be found in the wild or found with someone riding them. But I'll show you guys which horses you can find riding on or in the wild and ones that you can only get only once. Which is I think I know is the white the white Arabian and also the uh Brado Arabian. I think I'm not I think I'm saying it right. Which is a new horse from the update that I will show you when I get to my stables. And when I do you guys are probably going to be amazed from the horses that I kept that I like and I've been selling them but I've been trying to figure out who should I keep and who should I don't keep so that's been becoming an issue for me because I'm running very low on money but since we are near to the stables I'm going to sell this horse then I'm going to show you guys the well my stables and I think you could find one of these new horses in here. Alright, none of these new horses are in here, but there's a um, buttermilk chestnut, I think, which is a new horse. Um, and I think there's also another horse. I don't know. Look how sparkling this horse is. Alright, so I'm going to sell... Alright, so here we go. Manage your own horses. So, you know, we have Sylvus. We also have Sylvia, which is who is my white Arabian. We have me, the bridal Arabian, if I'm saying it right. Yep, warped bridal Arabian. And then we have uh, Katie, which is this new horse that I'm thinking I should name Mint instead of Katie, but I'm not too sure if you guys want me to name this horse Mint from Amino. If you know what Amino is or not. If you don't know what Amino is, it's a community app where you can chat with your friends or make friends or start doing a VC instead of actually calling on your phones. But if you want me to change this horse's name to Mint instead of Katie, I will. But if you guys want me to change the name, you guys have to leave a comment or give at least this video 50 likes and I will change this horse's name for you whichever you want the most name that gets the most likes gets to name this horse and be for its ever horse so and this is a few spotted and it's uh, uh Apoposa I think that's how you say it so we are going to find this horse <laughs> between Tumbleweed and also um Armadillo so I'm gonna take Silas here. I'm gonna go into the wilderness and I'm gonna create my campsite. I'm probably gonna fall off the cliff. And then I'm gonna go travel to probably Armadillo is the closest location. I am not too sure. So we're gonna go to Armadillo. I'm gonna go on back on YouTube and look to see if 
it's the right location to find the few spotted horse. And remember, these horses are some of them are not for online. Most of them are for offline, which is the few spotted, the horse I'm riding on, the uh, roped Brendo horse, the but, uh, buttermilk uh, horse skin, and others. So I'm going to go on YouTube and look for this horse location. Be I'm probably already going to be finished before I can even find the location for this. <laughs> so right now I'm looking on YouTube and I'm looking for it. Alright, so here we are. So I'm going to wait until I can get to the map location of it. Come on. Alright, so... Come on, show the map, please. Okay, so it's underneath the L and the A of Hola Springs, I think. Hola Springs. It's between here. That's where the person caught it. So I'm going to come here and see if we can find this horse. <laughs> but I'm probably going to do the same thing as I did to the Red Arabian. I'm not even too sure. But Armadillo came down with some weird sickness that I never... I am so sorry. Did I just kill it? I killed the dog! That was an accident. Okay, so... What was I saying? Alright, um... What I did to the Red Arabian is exactly what I'm gonna do to tame this type of wild horse. Now this wild horse it might be the perfect horse that you want. Be like, oh, that's the awesome horse that I want. Coco, thank you for showing me how to get it. But if you want to get it the hard way by just running into it with your horse and just roping it, be my guest. But for me, I would rather do it on foot. Yes, on foot. So when you get close to a location, you want to try and slow down because they could be on cliffs, they could be near the road. They could be um, more deeper into woods, into like the desert. So you want to be careful when you go up to this location. But right now I'm probably not even close. So I'm going to keep running with my pal Sivlis here. I'm probably going to make my character eat. Which is John Martian. Okay, so here's the place where this guy tamed the horse. And I think I see it up there. I'm not too sure if, that, if that's the horse. I can't even tell if that's a horse. I don't even know if that's a horse. Is that a horse? No, it's not. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? Alright, I'm pretty much seeing things. So this is where the person found and I think tamed the horse here you might want to be very careful of what you're doing me I'm probably gonna accidentally run into these guys so I'm gonna get out my lasso so I'm probably gonna accidentally run into them These guys are very picky out here though. You can probably spend hours or minutes trying to find these wild horses. For me, it took me like a second to find it. But this time, it might take me hours. Or it might be on the other side. Last time when I found it, it was on the road. There's a snake! Okay, so... There's another snake! Oh, wait, here it is. Alright, so I think those are horses. So let me see before I completely freak the heck out my horse. I can't even do anything because my horse is freaking out. 
Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Please. Alright, so I'm gonna get my binoculars out. Alright, so there's a here is the buttermilk buckskin. And this is a this is the few spotted horrors that you have all been looking for. The apple pole stuff. So if you wanna find probably find that location for the horse that I found it, it's probably here. Right here. So I'll give you a minute to look at it. Okay, so if you guys got the location that I'm at, I'm probably going to get a little bit closer or do this on foot. Wait, is that another? Wait, hold on. There are two horses. Hold on. There's a few spotted. And now there's another few spotted. Alright, this is going to be tricky. Because if you want a male or female, you have to figure out which one's a male or female. But if there's two... But you better hurry up and capture one and let the other one run with the other wild horse. So I'm going to go for the one that's away from the herd. Before I scare it. So I want to get off here and I want to crouch. Now again, these guys can easily run away from you without you getting close to it. I don't even know if I'm even getting close to it. I want to keep doing what I'm doing just in case. Alright, so he or she found us. We're gonna keep crouching. Now excuse me, but let's become friends. Easy now. Nice. Alright, so that horse is gonna run the other way. Then I'm gonna get on this. And then I'm gonna go try and tame this guy. Come on. You're gonna like me if you like it or not. Oh my god. Alright, so I don't know. So I don't know if this is a male or female, but I'm gonna let it calm down. I don't know if this is a male or female. This is a female, okay. <laughs> and what you want to do next... I don't know which other way the horse went. Any horse tracks? It only shows the buttermilk skin horse. Doesn't show the other one. So the other one must have been a male or another female. But this is the buttermilk skin if you want me to run right next to it, not tame it or anything, just run right next to it. This horse can be easily taken. And it's a very beautiful horse, as you can tell. It's going crazy because I'm legit chasing the horse, making the horse run away for his goddamn life. <laughs> So, if you guys want the buttermilk skin, um, you can come to where I was, or if you want the few spotted, it can only be around this area. I don't know what the other one went, though, because there's... Alright, there it is. See, look. There's the other horse. It's running with the herd. Come here. So if, oh that's not the same horse, okay. But if you want the same horse, like two of the horses, you have to probably do it quickly. Or try and shoot them, but not kill them. Because if you shoot them probably once or twice, they'll probably be bleeding out and they'll fall. And once they fall, you will be able to get the other horse or you will be able to actually tame the horse by reviving it before you can even do anything to it so there's your way of how to get those two awesome horses that are in the game for me um the there's also another horse 
that will be found I won't go to the location but I will show you on the map so if you want another horse that is you think much perfect than the other you might want to come probably somewhere here around here near the waterfall I think somewhere around here around the waterfall I believe or is it down here? I know it's somewhere up here. It's probably above the R right here. But if you want to go and get another horse, try and search this location here. And you might find the horse that you want. Remember, it's right here by uh, Brandy Vine Drop. I think it's around here. Right above the R. Right above here. So if you guys want to um, go collect one of those horses or collect all of them if you have enough room in your stables, go ahead and um, go and get those horses. But if you enjoyed this live stream of how to find the two best horses in the game, uh, leave, drop a like, uh, leave a comment, and I'll probably see you guys in probably the next video. Or maybe a week now because I've been going back to school and I've been having problems at school, problems at home. So if you guys want me to make more videos or get new games to play or try, I just heard a cougar. Okay, so if you guys want me to try, I'm going to come in here because they can't get me in here. If you guys want to try to actually really want me to play other games or if you guys want me to play Red Dead Online with my friend Lemon Squeezy who is Sibless, I will if you guys want me to or I will ask him if he wants to do a live stream on it with me but it's up to him, I'm not forcing him any or anything, I'm not forcing anybody. Is that the same necklace? The um. Is that? Hold on. Oh, okay. None of mine. I don't care about it anymore. Okay. Um, but if you guys want me to do a live stream with my friend Lemon Squeezy, um, leave a comment down on this video. If you want me to, I'm not gonna force him. It's his decision, and he has a cousin named Mortal Gaming. I don't know if you guys know him or not. You probably do. Um, if you go on YouTube and go to Home Sweet Home, uh, Mortal Gaming, you might be able to see, um, uh, two people that says run and it should say Mortal Gaming. So if you guys want me to play with both of them or with one of them, leave a comment down below on this video. And I will ask him, and if they want to, then then maybe we will do it one day but I will not force them I cannot force them I don't even want to force them because I don't want to lose friendship with them but if you guys do want them to play with me on Red Dead Online or if you guys want to play with me on Red Dead, Red Dead Online you can yes you can you can all you have to do is just say Coco what is your name tag or what is your name on ps4 and i will tell you but it will show my real name which is what i don't like i do not like my real name but um if you just want me to call me coco or a girl gamer i'm all right with that but if you guys did enjoy this video please leave a like comment subscribe also for more videos like this and uh, if you guys want me to play Red Dead Online with you or my two friends that I mentioned, who is who is Lemon Squeezy, aka Sibless Immortal Gaming, aka Sibless's cousin. So if you guys want me to play with them, leave a like. I don't know why I did that, but if you guys want me to play with them, leave a like, and I will see you guys probably in the next video in my seconds or minutes or hours or weeks or years but if you guys do enjoy this awesome video of finding these two amazing horses go ahead and leave a like on both of these 
uh, videos well this video if you want but this is one beautiful horse I don't know if you guys want this horse or not but if you guys do want this horse go ahead and go to my channel or someone else's channel to actually find these horses locations if you want to find more horse locations just like this you can always let me know down in the comments or you can find them by yourself on YouTube so I'll probably see you guys later probably in the next uh, episode of Red Dead Redemption and uh, I'll see you guys probably later on this awesome event that is happening on Red Dead Redemption. So that's it for all of you guys. If you guys did enjoy it, again, leave a like. Smash the hell out of that um, button right there in the subscribe. Just, just smack the heck out of it. And if you guys do want me to do more, again, leave a comment. If you want me to play with my friend, I'm a squeezy or mortal. It's whatever you guys want me to do. So if you guys do want me to play with them, leave a like. Actually, leave a comment. Smack the heck out of the like button. Especially the notifications bell. And, um, probably see you guys later. So I hope you guys did enjoy it. And I'll see you guys probably later in the who knows? Alright. Later, everybody.